Behind me is the western coastline of India, Goa to be precise. What's the length of the Goan coastline? Well, different sources show different values. 103 kilometers, 160 kilometers, 130 kilometers. Why such a huge variation? Turns out, measuring the length of a coastline isn't really so simple. First, let's see how we measure any curve. Let's take this curve. To measure it, we can draw small lines along the curve and add them all up. If we make the lines shorter, they'll represent the curve more closely and we'll get a more accurate measure. Or we could use a thread, which is equivalent to drawing extremely small lines. So, as the measurement precision increases, the curve length gets more and more accurate. So can we do the same to precisely measure a coastline? Well, no. Dividing the coastline into extremely small lengths and adding them all up just won't work. Why is that? Look at the coastline. It might look like a simple curve, but if you zoom in, you can see lots of irregularities and wiggles. These irregularities are the bays, lagoons and creeks. Now, measuring these might improve the precision, but if you zoom in further, you will find more of them and they can be almost never ending. For example, let's look at this one. If you follow and measure every creek, you will reach very far from the actual coast. And if we include all of it, we'll end up getting a value much larger than the actual length. Similarly, the bays or the lagoons have these rocks. From far, they look like a smooth curve and it seems like we can measure them easily. But look closely. There are so many of these from huge rocks to tiny pebbles. Further up close, these rocks have lots of small crevices. Crevices inside crevices inside crevices, which never seem to end. So if we use a really small scale to include every single pebble, every crevice, we will end up much far from a realistic estimate. Whereas if we use a bigger scale, the measure becomes inaccurate again. This time, much smaller than the actual length. So where do we stop? Can't really tell. This weird counterintuitive occurrence is famously known as the coastline paradox. The paradox arises due to the hidden complexities of the coastline and it has forever troubled anyone seeking the accurate measurement of any coastline. 